You're looking at the victims of shipping abuse. Crates that slipped, bags that broke, cans that got warm and warped. The fact is, it takes a lot of work to create a great product. But once it's out of your hands and off to market, how can you guarantee that it stays great? One way is by protecting it with a pallet wrap that delivers. FlexNet by Tama, the one and only wrap with a built-in memory. Del Monte is a name synonymous with quality food products all over the world. Del Monte relies on FlexNet. We've used uh, several different types in the past, but uh, we found that they just didn't grip the can, grip the uh, product the way it should. And uh, if you're rolling down the highway with a big truck, you don't want cans bouncing off the automobiles. So the grip of the Taminet is the best we've ever seen. In fact, it's the only one we've ever seen that uh, would grip the pallet and hold things together. FlexNet is a breakthrough in pallet wraps. Its patented built-in memory action snaps back after stretch to provide optimum tension and grip on any size, any shape, any shipment. And that's not all. FlexNet's unique third dimension action exerts tension over the top of the shipment for an extra measure of reassurance. FlexNet lets your shipment breathe. That means your products stay fresh since air circulates freely and there are no condensation problems. Rugged, strong FlexNet is exceptionally easy to use, as you'll see. But what we have uh, come up against in the past with the other types of web wraps is there's no memory uh, to that material to where with the Taminet, there is a built-in memory. Uh, if you have some shift to the pallet, uh, it will return back to the previous shape. Now we'll show you how quick and easy it is to get a grip on any shipment with FlexNet. Watch. To make sure you make the most out of flex wrap, follow these guidelines. Start by attaching the net to the bottom of the pallet. Tie, knot, or staple it. Before wrapping, decrease tension to its minimum. Slowly increase the tension as you feel stronger resistance and see that the triangles elongate. Test tension manually to see that the width is reduced from 20 to 15 inches. To do this, count about 10 triangle peaks and measure the distance from the first to the last. Once the net is stretched, the distance should be at least 30% more. FlexNet Super Stretchability yields at least 30% more wrap per bale. That means you can wrap 30% more pallets per roll, and that translates into substantial savings. This is the feet-in, feet-out indicator of a typical FlexNet customer. The difference is obvious. Use a two to three inch overlap. Make two to three revolutions at the top of the pallet. The net should extend over the top by at least three inches. Continue wrapping down to the bottom. Secure the net at the starting point by tying, knotting, or stapling.
See how the flex net clings to every sharp corner, curve, and angle. Note how the crates are anchored at all critical points. If your machine has a pre-stretching device, make sure that maximum stretch is no more than 50%. Check that the appropriate tension gear wheel is installed. FlexNet packs a lot of muscle, but you don't have to be a muscle man to use it. When manual wrapping, just follow the same initial steps mentioned in the automatic wrapping sequence. As you round the corners, make sure to give the wrap an extra tug to assure optimal tension and grip. If you're using a manual wrapping device, turning the handle will increase or decrease the tension. Secure the flex net wrap by tying, knotting, or stapling at the starting point. Now you're ready to take flex net for a test drive. Uh, to knock it down, to knock the product down. It, it holds very well. It's the best netting I've ever used. Wherever your destination, FlexNet goes the distance. It's engineered so that everything stays in place. Your shipment is secured, properly balanced, with energy distribution that exerts just the right pressure at critical points. The pallets always stay very square. And FlexNet's unique third dimension exerts an extra measure of tension on the top. Unlike stretch film, FlexNet lets the shipment breathe so there's no moisture buildup or condensation problems. And no matter how many destination points, FlexNet snaps right back into shape even after partial unloading. Just look at the difference. Here's a pallet wrapped with ordinary wrap. And here's a pallet wrapped with FlexNet. The condition generally after the uh, ship arrives from Costa Rica has been good. Uh, the condition of the pallets, the structure of the pallet, the rigid rigidity of the pallet has been good. We've had a lot of success with the net wrap uh, as opposed to the corner post and banding. Removing flex net from the pallet is this simple. And disposal is as easy as crushing it into a ball. In fact, unlike other wraps, FlexNet is so compressible that wrapping from up to 300 pallets fits into a single 20-gallon trash can. Environmentally friendly FlexNet poses no health hazards and is completely recyclable. No matter what shape the shipment or pallet, FlexNet's flexibility and grip action adhere to every corner or curve, creating a tight, stable unit. 
The netting for us works real well on our table grade boxes in that it keeps it snug, it's uh, held intact, we have no problems of uh, arriving in uh, damaged product because of the netting, that has never happened. FlexNet 30-inch rolls are especially effective for customers seeking high productivity and increased output. Using them, wrapping speed is 50% faster than with 20-inch rolls. We are trying to keep ahead of the industry and Taminet, as far as we're concerned, is one of the best. You've worked hard to produce a product you're proud of. Give it the special treatment it deserves and give yourself peace of mind knowing everything's under control with FlexNet. Only feature-packed FlexNet has everything you're looking for in a pallet wrap. Simply a wrap that assures your shipment reaches its destination in the same perfect condition it started out. FlexNet by Tama, the one and only wrap with a built-in memory.